Meghan Markle and Prince Harry will eventually secure King Charles' reunion but not in time for Christmas. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex are unlikely to reunite with the royal family at Christmas but a reconciliation may not be far off if they continue to keep a low profile. Welcome to Royal Pancakes. If you are new here, please don't forget to subscribe and click the notifications bell, so you don't miss any news about the British monarchy. Harry and Meghan have been working on reconciling with the royal family. Meghan Markle and Prince Harry will only secure their long-awaited reunion with King Charles if they stop trashing the royal family in the media. But the release of the bombshell Omid Scobie book could have set their strained relationship with the monarch back even more. According to reports, the Duchess of Sussex is seeking a part-time reconciliation with the firm in a bid to repair the fractured family. But it will only go ahead if the couple stop publicly attacking the Duke's family, which they have done on various occasions. The pair spoke to King Charles on the phone to wish him a happy birthday, and it was hoped this could be the start of a happier relationship. However, revelations published in Meghan's former friend Mr. Scobie's Endgame book is said to have caused more anger among the royal family. Meghan has been weighing up spending eight months of the year in California, where she currently resides in Montecito, and then the rest of their time renting an apartment in Kensington Palace. It would be the first time she has had a permanent base in the UK since leaving the royal fold in 2020. She is set to believe this arrangement could potentially aid in repairing the strains on her marriage with Prince Harry while also helping to mend their relationship with King Charles, who has expressed a desire for the family to be reunited. But the monarch would demand that the couple stop trashing his family in the media for this idea to work. An insider told Life and Style magazine, Meghan and Harry have to agree not to speak ill of the royals again. That's a must. It would be an utter embarrassment if they were to be kicked out of the family for a second time. It is not known yet whether the couple will be invited to Sandringham to spend Christmas with the firm, but relations have been mending between the two warring families. But the release of Endgame and the controversy surrounding it may have delayed a potential reunion. Royal expert Duncan Larkham claimed that there was little chance of a festive royal reconciliation but said that the door was not fully shut on them all getting along once again. He told New Magazine, I think the Sussexes are aware the Prince and Princess of Wales are still furious. There's always a way back. Look at Camilla she was the most hated person in Britain and now she's the Queen. If that's possible, anything's possible. But as things stand at the moment, I'd say it's pretty unthinkable. Meghan was reported to be upset about media reports claiming that the couple were undergoing financial difficulties as they look set to rebrand following the failure of their Spotify deal. She has been linked to a return to acting due to the success of Suits on Netflix. The pair still have a multi-million pound deal with the streamer but it is not known whether this will be renewed due to a number of their shows flopping, including their Invictus documentary.